the hearts, financial favor to give people, move on the hearts of people to support it. Father God, to buy the teas, to buy the support, the tea sips ministry. Father God, to prevent human trafficking and prevent the people in Sri Lanka, whatever, how you pronounce that country, and other places, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that the T cells will go up and the support and Father God and financial provision will go up, Father God, from people. That you will move on the hearts of people all over the world, all over America, to give to T cells and other organizations that is working to prevent the human trafficking among children and adults. In Jesus Christ's name, I thank you for your supernatural hand of favor and flow in that, Father God, and your work. Father, you are working powerfully and strongly, and you are a God that answers by fire. Father God, and you got a mighty hand and your arm is strong. Father God, and I thank you for taking your hand to punch the devil out with your right mighty hand on the ground and that you are choking, you are knocking his head off, cutting his head off with your fiery sword and stomping it down into the ground to not, Father, deep below the ground. And you're stomping all over the devil on top of it, Father God, and piercing him up with your fiery swords, Father God. And you are releasing your holy fires to burn him up completely with your judgmental fires, your correcting fires, and that you are executing your judgment on Satan and his demonic cohorts that are participating in coming against your lambs, coming against the children that you have created that belongs only to you, Lord. These children belong to you, and I thank you that you are snatching them right back out of the hands of Satan. That you're going in the enemy count along with your warrior angels and your angelic sheriffs to snatch these kids out of the hands of Satan, out of the hands of their controllers and, and manipulators and abusers, Father God, and handlers in Jesus Christ's name, and pharaohs, that you are burning up the spirit of Pharaoh and slavery and imprisonment out, Father God, with your holy fires off of these children, off of the adults and any human trafficking programs and other slavery programs and in slavery gain stocking programs with your holy fires that you are freeing the lambs. You are freeing the children. You are freeing your people, Father God, in Jesus Christ forever. And that you are bringing them into a land of promise, Father God, and enlargement and jubilee, Father God, and blessing and deliverance and healing, Father God, that you release your healing waters upon these children, your healing anointing, your healing power upon these children and their minds to heal their souls and personalities and their wills and their emotions, Father, to heal their bodies, to heal their pain and their sores and their afflictions, Father God, from deep satanic ritual masochistic abuse and from emotional and verbal abuse and isolation and abandonment and neglect, Father God, and, and separation issues, Father God, being separated from their families and their parents and stuff in Jesus Christ's name. And Father God, that you release justice for the many children that died behind in human for human sacrifice, Father God, the lambs of your children, of children, and the lambs of your children, Father God, your children that died, that committed suicide behind these gang stalking programs, behind the covert gang stalking program. I thank you for just shutting it all down and putting an end to it, Father God, all of the human trafficking. That you're doing a great and mighty miracle, Father God, even though it looks impossible that you're burning up every demon that's operating through the leadership, the deep state, the government, the law enforcement department, the military with your holy fires down to the ashes, to the ground, to not in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I pray, Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, that you will help us to fight for our children, that you will put back and restore our to test her on, Father God, and our boldness to fight and not to be jelly worms, Father God, for the devil. But we will be warrior fighters and be vigilant against our adversary and that you will put the fight back us in us to fight for our children, to speak up and fight for our children, Father God. And that you will restore whatever you, the weapons that we need physically and spiritually. 
to fight for our children and to fight for the children of God, to fight for the innocence from children to adults, to fight for our lives too, Father God, because they're after our lives too. And to give me the strength and courage to be a warrior person, Father God, that you will show us wisdom and understanding what to do besides pray, what to do besides talk, besides speak up, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you will give us wisdom and witty ideas and a revelation of how to fight and what to do by action in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, besides prayer, besides speaking up, Father God, that you will help us to be open and speak up about it and deal with it and not shove it under the rug anymore, Father God, that you will wake these people up in America, that you will burn all the spirits of stupidity and blindness and blindfolding demons off of their eyes and off of them with your holy fires and with the blood of Jesus Christ, Father God, and that you will bring a stronger awareness upon the people and that you will break them off of the spirit of denial and hiding, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. And I pray, Father God, that the judgment that you're bringing upon the perpetrators that come against the children and the innocents and the adults and your children, Father God, that they cannot escape your judgment and your punishment and your vengeance, Father God, and they will not be able to hide. They won't be able to blame and cover up and run somewhere else, Father God, because they cannot hide from you. They cannot box with you. They cannot manipulate you and lie to you because you are God. You see everything. You are the all-knowing God, all omnipresent God, the all-seeing God. And you see greater than the eye of Lucifer, greater than the eye of Horus, Father God. And Father God, you're God all by yourself and you're a bad God. You're a dynamite warrior God and you are kicking the devil's butt and his demon's butt from coming against your people, from coming against the children that you have created. These wonderful children, Father God, that has been killed by abortion clinics, Father God, that have been killed by the human trafficking programs, by the Satanists doing killing them and torturing them before they kill them and stuff, that you will put a stop to this torture and abuse and this killing and this slavery and this hostage, Father God, and this stealing and abductions, that you will burn up these abduction and murder spirits with your holy fires down to the ashes to the ground, that you will burn up the spirits of witchcraft, Jezebel, Father God, Ahab, with your holy fires down to the ashes to the ground, that you will burn up the spirit of control and manipulation and lying and leviathan and proud spirits and selfishness and narcissistic spirits with your holy fires, the spirits of pan and fawn with your holy fires and animalistic spirits and every evil spirit of mammon and greediness father god and selfishness with your holy fires is causing these men to do this out of money father god with abortions and with the children and the human trafficking and abductions that you will burn up that money and destroy it with your holy fires and curse that money that any perpetrator is making off of these children and off of the innocence father god that you will curse that money because that is blood money that is money out of murder and dishonesty father god and that you will curse that money and let it be a snare to the perpetrators that come against the children in your innocence and the innocence father god and any slave program and the human trafficking program, Father God, and the gain stocking programs that you, Father God, will pull the red carpet underneath these Satanist perps and these witches, Father God, that's coming against these children and pedophiling them, Father God, that you release your judgment on the pedophiles and pedophilia people, Father God, and that you will burn up these perversion spirits and destroy these perversion spirits and these pedophilia, these freaky spirits, Father God, with your holy fires, these spirits of lust, with your holy fires, these mammon greedy devils, Father God, with your holy fires, these perversion evil entities with your holy fires, these lesbian homosexuality spirits, Father God, with your holy fires, transgendering spirits with your holy fires down to the ashes to the ground with the blood of Jesus Christ, that you pour the blood of Jesus Christ to judge these evil entities and deities that's operating through the perpetrators, that you will break these evil spirits off of the perpetrators, that you will break and that you will convict them with the fires of the Holy Spirit and the correcting fires of the Holy Spirit, that you release your correcting 
placing fires and convictions upon these perpetrators, Father, that come against the children, that come against the innocents and your children and the human trafficking program and all other slavery programs and gain stocking programs. In Jesus Christ's name. That you release your correcting fires and convictions upon the leadership in the deep state government, military, law enforcement department, police department, the FEMA, the FBI, CIA, CPS, deep state, Father God, and all agencies and businesses and churches, Father God, and organizations everywhere, all over the world, all over the country. Father God of America and Canada, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, that you release your heavy hand of correction, that they will feel your presence, the heaviness of your correcting hand, your heaviness of your hand upon them, Father, that the leadership in the high places of rulership, Father God, will feel the, your correcting hands and convictions upon them, Father God, in your presence, and that you will make them miserable in sin, that you will make these perps miserable in their sin, Father God, that you will make them so miserable that they will cry out to Jesus and they will stop and repent, or they just stop, Father God, that you will make them miserable in sin to the extreme, Father God. In hurting the children and hurting the innocents and doing this human trafficking and other slavery programs and doing these abortions to the babies, Father God, that you will make these Satanists and witches convict them and make them repent, Father God, cause them to repent, that you will soften up those stony hearts into flesh and burn off those Jezebel, stiff neck, rebellious, anti-Christ demons, anti Children hating demons out of them, these perpetrating demons, Father, these persecution devils, Father God, these perversion devils off out of them, Father God, with your holy fires, and that you release the blood of Jesus Christ to convict them, to convict their demons, Father God, and that you release your power and your correcting fires to convict them, Father God, and show them what you want then to stop doing this, show them what they're doing is wrong, that you will open up their eyes and move all blindfolders and deceiving and, dis- and seduction spirits off them, the perpetrators, off the minds of the perpetrators that come against the innocents, the children to adults in these slavery programs and the human trafficking. That you will move on the hearts that's holding these kids hostage in strange, isolated places and that's torturing and abusing them and doing satanic ritual abuses toward them and deep programming against them, Father God, even in Hollywood, that you will stop this in Hollywood with the children too, what these perpetrators are doing to the children and the adults in Jesus Christ and free them too, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you will step in and supernaturally intervene in that as well, in Jesus Christ's name, and that you release your correcting fires upon the wicked leaders in Hollywood, Father God, that's perpetrating the children to adults. That you will convict them and release your correcting fires upon them 24-7 every hour out of the day, including today, every day, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. That your heavy hand of conviction will be upon them every day, today, every hour within the day that you will send your ministering angels to warn them to stop and to repent. And that you will make them miserable in Hollywood and doing the sins that they're doing against the children and the adults and the innocence of your lambs, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. That you will make them so miserable that they cannot even barely move. And I pray that you will stiffen and paralyze these demons that are coming against the children and stiffen them with your power and your anointing. Father God, that you will paralyze these demons and make them frail and weak that come against these children. That demons of abuse and Satanism and witchcraft and control and manipulation and Satanism. Father God, that come against the children operating through these perpetrator handlers and controllers. All spirits of control and domination and bullying spirits. All spirits of abuse of all types and perversions. Father God, to deliver the children from the transgendering sex rings too, Father God, and the prostitution rings all over America, in California, in Texas, and in North Carolina, all over the world, and the United States of America, Father God, in Canada, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, that you will put a stop to this evil perversion with the children with the transgendering and the puberty being Father God is stop and stunting the children's puberty in Jesus Christ's name and injecting them with vaccines and forcing them to take vaccines and forcing their parents and putting their parents in jail while they steal their kids and stuff and accusing them and assassinating them things 
that they're not even guilty of doing, Father God, and ruining their lives with that, that you'll restore that and that you will restore justice for them, Father God, and vindicate these parents, Father God, bring vindication and validation for these parents that have been abused in the system of the CPS and DC.